Now, I'm gonna give shout outs where shout outs are due. This is Afro Senji's video. I don't know if he's actually playing the game. Oh, it looks like he actually is. Wow. All right, let's just jump into this. Super day. How to bring it back to an oldie, bro. No pants. We came in this for no pants. We gotta end it with no pants. Thank you to Banda Namco for allowing me and the homies and whoever else, allowing the opportunity for early capture of Dragon Ball Sparking Zero to be captured and me to be there. A round of applause. It's fire. Now look, there's so much that I got and there's so much that I wanna show and I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna show it. I do wanna quickly add this build had 40 plus characters. We are here for it. We are here for it. Literally, I guess I'm I'm partly a React channel now because I don't know what else to say when I don't have the game. We could play with. I chose the ones that. Let's throw on the captions because again, part of this video is, you know, Afro Senju's video. Hold on, let me move this aside. In everything we wanted, and I know that sounds like a lot of time, but it really wasn't. On to the first match. Don't judge too heavily. This is me kind of figuring out the controls. In this demo, you had two different control schemes. It was standard and it was classic. Now, I standard like and classic controls is very interesting for a game that's a button masher. They did that same thing with Storm 4. We've already been there. If you guys don't know, Storm 4 has modern controls. I don't see a single soul using it. That could also be because not a single soul is playing the game, but that's beyond the point. When the people were playing the game, I did not see anybody using modern controls. And even if they were, I don't think you'd be able to tell the difference like you could in other games like Street Fighter. A lot more done frame one if I went to classic, but I don't know what happened. My ADHD zoomed in the minute I got my hands on the I have ADHD too. Diagnosed, it's really bad. So I know what he's talking about. I have to take medicine for it. Controller, and I didn't even care to do it. Now, with that being said, uh, my combos are gonna look very basic in the beginning, but that's cool okay. because I'm just, you know, seeing a few things as I go. See, and that's that's cool. That's what we need. We need people like you on the scene, Afro. Come on. Like this, for instance, I could not block the death beam. I don't know if you can block any supers at all, or maybe you can't Wait, block the beam. Wait, like the maximum the ones, like or the super? cannon or death beam? But yeah, that got me half naked. That was crazy. Like I just got here, and now the shirt. You're off. asking it's for insane. the maximum. Then. Um, this. I don't think you can block the maximum. If you can, it's gonna take a lot of damage. New <laughs> super entirely. I think this oh, is like a combination. That's sick. Between how kid boot. I love that one right there. I love that. Absolutely insane. I had to let him know. Th this is crazy. Udai. I did my due diligence. I let him know. And something else. I don't know what the something else is. Let me know if I just simply don't know what that is. But Wait, what? The nation what between how Kid Boo died Which? and something else. I don't know what the... I know what he's talking about. It's the goodbye. But those balls, I remember him using them on Frieza as well. And the Namek arc, but it wasn't the way he used them there. He never used it like that there. It could be game exclusive. What does that say? Dragon Burst? That could be game something exclusive. Something else is. Let me know if I just simply don't know what that is. But no, I don't know what yeah, it is either. I think that's just game exclusive. That, this is when I learned you cannot block the death beam. Oh. Died and something else. I don't know what the something else is. Let me know if I just simply don't know what that is. I guess you can't block death but, beam. That's crazy. Yeah. Death beam guy, I, I, that this is when I learned you cannot block the death beam. <laughs> I tried a second time. He tried it a second I time. <laughs> I wasn't even gonna fight it, brother. <laughs> That's um, funny. <laughs> yeah, back shots, we do love those. One thing I do think I love a lot. But oh, that be, uh, camera uh, angle! Did you way. guys see that? That was actually <laughs> really cool. It, that looked like a um, actual yeah, manga back panel. Shots, we do love those. One thing. Hold I, on, I got you guys. I, I got you guys. I got you guys. That right there looked like a manga panel, bro. That looked like a straight manga panel. We're only a minute in, dude. That looked like a straight manga panel. Love a lot, but it might be a, a, a hot topic for some people. The camera. Camera's a lot more dynamic than past Tekken yeah, games. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Um, Do you in, like in it? In some instances, I can see you getting a little dizzy or sick from it. Exactly. Maybe, possibly, mm -hmm, but mm -hmm. I don't think so. If you're not dramatic like myself, you're just going to like it and enjoy it. Mm -hmm. I had no shirt on. You saw who he just stripped me naked in a matter of three death beams, by the way. That's crazy. That's insane. Yeah, that My is Vegeta crazy. Gameplay, is not crazy almost more so lackluster than the goku okay. one All in right. this case because i was trying to figure out how to transform that's fine that's cool that's cool this trailers i've seen has something to do with the number little icon under vegeta and you don't you don't know what that I does 
what that does oh hold on. the left i think left d-pad the right d-pad yeah i can then you know use my supers but i couldn't find no that's that's not what that stock is for if you use that which the variation of your vegeta depending on the variation when that stock goes up you can actually transform and then on top of that what you don't know that stock also allows you to use those the ones that are on the d-pad right there the explosive wave and all warmed up so i don't know which version of vegeta this is so i don't know which version you'll be able to change to but explosive wave using that as a stock that's your get out of jail free card and all warmed up that is when the, the match is like later on in you can use that to either buff or debuff the enemy i don't know what arm all warmed up does depend from what it sounds like it, it buffs you up so i think your damage would get crazier and your Almost defense would be so as well all right let's get back to where we know, were hold the left i think left d-pad the right d-pad i can then you know use my supers but i couldn't uh, that that's why i was just explaining transform oh not later, to transform just, oh, you know okay. what you're seeing me go through you can get a little sneak peek of the control nice i like that it's yeah you're going through it a little bit fast buddy i'm trying to engage in it so i can play it mentally you know like come on bro once your key has been maxed out your gauge will turn to a sparking gauge once the sparking gauge is full you will use one skill count to enter sparking mode you're seeing me go through explosive wave uses one kill count all right skill why did i say kill count skill count Creates a key explosive wave blowing away opponents. Yeah, can be used while under attack, and that's cool. So yeah, that makes you have to think about it. You can all warmed up. Enter sparky mode immediately. Okay, that's crazy. Get a little sneak peek of. Uh, I almost saw what that last one was. Galat gun. It says a beam. Thirty thousand key required. Oh, does that mean it's just three, three bars? That's how they're doing it. Uh. All right, inflicts heavy damage. Blast impact. I don't know what blast impact does. It doesn't seem like it's showing that. Forward, back, left, right. All right, that's cool. The, the normal really stuff. Normal stuff. A uh, short dash. Move quickly, just a little when at a distance from opponent. That's the stuff I was telling you about when you normally attack. Excuse me. In old games, if you guys saw in my last video, I was talking about how in some games, if you press square or you press the attack button, it immediately puts you in the same distance so you can actually hit it, assuming the the opponent didn't move. This game doesn't do that. You have to dash up and attack. You have to do two button presses. So maybe that's why they have like modern controls and regular controls. So like the modern controls automatically dashes you up so you can do the attack. Where regular controls you have to actively do the inputs. Uh, dragon dash, dragon ascend. Whoa. Z Z burst dash. You can see. Okay. And I'm yep, stressing yep, 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 too. Go and i'm stressing too because we only had so much time i can imagine brother uh press short dash oh okay hold down the button for an attack that sends your opponent flying backwards you can also follow up after step during rush attack rush in rush attack smash attack smash attack high low left right damn as much as i could all right rush chain lift strike grand slash dragon tornado aerial barrage rush high speed movement rush chain one Rush, rush chain one key blast cannon smash rush chain two heavy awesome. crush okay this is all looking pretty but, similar to know. um oh. budokai three with some uh, more attacks filthy. yeah that was all those attacks long range attacks with the key blast defense high low guard break and collapse that's interesting super perception that's the stuff we were talking about those are the counter techniques. Okay, consume key to use perception and counter your attack, your opponent's attack. The counter attack will change depending on your opponent's attack. Use this key or skill count depending on the counter attack. But it doesn't say if you can do something after it. God damn it, Senju. I wish you went down there. That would have been nice. For certain things. Oh, okay. He went down a little bit more. Never mind. I take it back, Senju. Inputs for certain things. Okay, revenge counter. The counter attack perform depends on your distance from the opponent. If at close range, you will perform a direct attack. If at long range, you will perform a dragon dash to get close to your opponent, then counter. Dang, okay. Dang, that's actually cool. Oh, wow, I really like that. If at mid range, you will perform a smash attack and get close to your opponent, and it uses a skill count. It uses one of those. One of those blue ones. Okay, cool. High speed evasion. Tell me which your opponent's attacks, and depending on their actions, you could evade. Oh, that's perfect counter. Okay, super counters. Use when it... Oh, that's the Z counters. Even though I okay. took a little peek at Super counter is Z sheet, counter now. I still went back to press and square. Oh, reliable, bro. I wanted to see just how much I can get away with just, just off generic mashing. And combos ended fairly quickly. You're, you're playing on modern controls, in there right? So. And a few key blasts as the next person comes in. But this is very bare bones. Um, Some of the combos, a, a lot of my... uh, 
I guess history with the Tenkaichi series that's memorable to me is within Raging Blast. Oh, and that's frame unfortunate. One, seeing that this is very different from that control scheme yeah, to me. It, it definitely is. Raging Blast did not play anything like the Kai Tenkaichi 3. And that's unfortunate that that's your only real experience with the Tenkaichi series. I was, you know, learning. I did my Final Flash, Vegeta Super, in base. The graphics, bro. The graphics, it's just green ranked. I love it. I, I'm glad they it. are. There's a few other cool things I've learned with that uh, awakening mode when you charge up the full. The match, you're gonna the see, sparking I, the mode. next match here. But yeah, just me bare bones, just pushing Beerus back, and he hit me with a hard parry. That's a Z counter. That was amazing, and or I the super think counter I understand what's called to now. Do that, but when I do it, I'll then explain it back to you. I think that's Dang, gonna be a key that's a nice factor grab. in high level play to this game. And I'm really curious to see just warmed where the up. depth goes in regards to getting Wait, did he like use warmed up? No, he used explosive wave. the movement itself, too. He keeps using um, right explosive Right now, I'm wave. just focusing on spamming as I charge up my Gallic gun. That looks so... Oh, my gosh, bro. Seeing it back, it looks so good, dude. And the key blast, Man, too. Man, this stage this? looks crazy. Look at the freaking shading on this building, bro. It looks like I can, like, turn my head and I'll, I'll, I'll be there. Like, that... These graphics are insane. As little as it seems, it felt so good. Dude, the buildings having stuff on it. It may not be anything crazy, but that's that's just like the show. They didn't have like crazy designs good, bro. on the, uh, on the buildings buddy in the to death show. As he nonchalantly died. I really Man, that, that dude is destroying the town. Of the high level play of this game. While I can't really tell you off the 30 minutes I played, if I could see any potential. I can tell you, Senju. Don't worry. I can definitely tell you. Blasts like that. Key Blast definitely will help because it's going to force situations. Now, if you're not using it properly with your key uh, management, then it's going to force you into bad situations because it is using your key. So you want to make sure that you're actually using your key into key baiting into some strong revenge counters. From what I'm seeing, the revenge counter system looks really strong. So you get something like that to get you started. Something strong or you can count or do a blast countered his strike into a whole ass beam can for sure just those quick engagements are enough to just diminish matches that in budokai tenkai ec3 it was a lot harder to actually hit those because of how insane the movement was i don't know if it's gonna be that way here i i really don't know but it definitely was uh it looked a lot more difficult the and is, there's too. going to be some level of cancel that this game has that the game is not going to teach you yourself bro the the, the movement i see is, is very solid but there's also a lot you can do with it that i just did by accident right anyways at this point in the gameplay i'm trying to figure out how to transform it, it's oh. pissing me off because i feel like i really can't like stretch my maybe this vegeta can't this transform big down bro um in a few seconds here i do figure it out uh, oh, never mind alert. i was lying everything takes place in the d-pad you can pull up your supers you can pull up your character trans uh, you ch ch changing a character it, there we it's go. all in the d-pads i figured it out for at least transformation i could have skipped the super saiyan god or super saiyan blue there but i wanted to you know match him from here so my next objective i can't tell if the move set is changing when you're in uh, against buddy within the time i have left there a was a very rare clash animation i saw the person next to me do and i was trying to trigger it here so bad like i was like hitting delayed hoping that he'll hit me at the same time we could do it but it, it just wasn't looking in the cards that was an interesting so I, camera angle I, right I tried there. To do this new Ooh. super i never recognized before a galactic mm. uppercut i believe mm. it's called mm. Dude, this i believe this is from the dang the, 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 that I, was nice i want to call it battle of z but I, battle of gods yes one of the I, one of those names i just said is the game and one is the movie i believe that was what he did on beerus and on to the next match nice. um i think my team is super trunks and the rest i'll figure out as we go but i think out of everybody i played with I think this Trunks was probably my favorite for one thing they added that I didn't see any game add in this way. Um, and yes, if you're asking, Beast Gohan was not in the build. I'm sorry. I don't even know if this is the same variant. I think well, I would, this is the Dragon Ball. I'm not going to lie. It would be crazy if Beast Gohan was in this build. Why would he be in a build at Summerfest? Well, Z Gohan. If Beast Gohan is a thing, it's not this one. That's for damn sure. But uh trunks is sick trunks is always sick i think that gohan is gonna be a dlc because he has a completely different move set uh starting with his supers bro i think i'm about to do one in a second here i'm gonna charge up and i think the first Lightning one i do is masenko no i transform i'm not playing no games buddy look at this look at this it's the rage trunks frame one. Oh, he you can't does see it now gohan. right but when i charge 
Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get into it. You see the blue aura on the side. I didn't recognize it here. You also see the lightning on him. It, I was just staring at it like, Oh, wait, Jesus, wait, that's on so Gohan, heavy, my fault. I think every game that this character was in thus far didn't have that. Even when you dash, I'm noticing that now, bro. Oh, my gosh. Like, they didn't have that, like, blue element of rage trunks. The only game that had that was uh, Legends. In a way that I, I, I found um, enjoyable, I guess. I think Xenoverse 2 did it the best, but... Bro, look at that. Look at that, bro. It's so sick. I do not agree it's with so his take subtle. on the inverse two trunks. Yeah, final flash is one move, which is just a super move, by the way, which is crazy. Like like Trunk said, forget burning attack and everything that made me me. I'm just taking what daddy Final got. hope slash. I think from here, I attempt to do the... Oh, this is Damn, another thing I learned. Did the burst when you're combo. in this awakening form, which Gohan went... Did you me, see how much damage that made, did? If you don't break me, out of that, you are just dead. Got. I think from here... Look, guys, look, look at this. I attempt to do the, oh, this is another thing I learned. When you're- Hello? In this awakening form- Damn, brother! Forget burning attack, another thing I learned. Dude, when like, th this is crazy. This I can't form, believe you didn't say anything about this, Senju. You, you didn't see the damage I'm there? Got. I think from here, oh, oh, I oh, attempt to do the, oh, this is another thing I learned. When you're in this awakening form- He brought down two bars! By just beating you up! Which Gohan went with me, you can just keep on pressing square and you're just in an infinite loop of a combo. I'm, there's a lot of ways to get out of it, but what he did get out of was my ultimate somehow. Did he perfect Shout block out to Dion that? for giving me footage of what the ultimate looked like because I, I didn't get it again in my footage. But bro, this is an AMV. This is an AMV. Trunks casually doing a movie on your opponent? Bro, the disrespect. Anyways, round two at the max key charged battle. Now, one thing that I caught here, uh, hold on, just pay attention, bro. Don't blink. Gohan does key blast. I eat those up. Do, I do not oh, you're flinch in sparking, that maxed out. Right. Now, this right here, I do not like too much. While what, when you guys are just out, mashing? Out, we could just press square infinitely. Yeah, we that's, that you guys are figuring other, out. It's the tactics. Death, it's the tactics. Little, mm, you gotta figure out tactics. Only thing that was a little you iffy to me out of what I played. I just didn't like how that felt. Um, Gohan took me out. Really interesting thing here. You see the color of the screen and why it's all grayed out. I thought it was a glitch, but if you if you see in like five seconds here, this is what it looks like when it's locked off. When it's locked on, the color is back, and you're just battling. Now That's a majority of my, uh, I guess. That's an interesting choice. Totally here, I'm not gonna say that I dislike it, but it is very. Well, I really wanted to see what his ultimate was in base, because they mm, had so mm. many choices. Oh yeah, we did see this. From, yes, sir. Movie, How are you right? feeling about this, Senju? And I think that's valid. <laughs> that was a valid choice. I like right, that a lot. All right. If it was a little bit longer, he did a few more things after that, right? You yeah, he started slamming them down, started <laughs> twirling them, and then he did that little. Crawr! That would be sick if he did that. Things, but it's cool. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. Uh, that was great. Bravo. Transformation. Bro, look how good this looks. Yeah. Oh, my. Yo, I didn't even catch that last time. Did you see that? Look at the freaking flare of rage. That's sick. Oh my gosh. They put rent on Broly. Dog. They put rent on brother. That's a super. It was it was pretty cool. Very, very linear. Um, I don't even know if Vegeta mm. even tried to dodge that if you if we go back and look at that. But Alright, I'm starting um, to see how I like the angle. Super Saiyan Broly um, definitely got the best drip here though. For the like, for the battle know, tactics dude, might... because it's it, it looks weird, but it's just the way the, the models are when they're actually at the angles they are. So it's like, even if they like slightly deviate, they'll they'll like go down a little bit. You know what I'm saying? So it looks it looks unorthodox because it's not supposed to be happening. Might be the main off of drip alone. But it's it's what that unorthodoxness is what's allowing you to be able to move freely. It's a little slow, I'm seeing, but. I don't know. I feel like it's good enough, bro. I'm, I'm killing Master Roshi's easily a Yamcha. Forget about it. Anyways, oh, gonna do the next super. I believe it's called Gigantic. Man, I bet you Rage. could do some crazy. This one I was really that. excited for because I, I, I think I. Okay, I don't know if Dang. I predicted what this was. Mm. I don't remember what I thought. Uh, I was we did. Oh, oh, oh. This is. Great. Oh, this yes, is great. sir. This is great. This is. That's great. nice. Bro, got I like red, that. Brother. Oh, How? Say in spirit. I, I, I wonder what those do. do it, but it would be cool if like I, I'm locked in, but I'm also keeping in mind that this is gameplay that we're going to be receiving in our hands, guys. <laughs> like he is, he is helping us eat right now. <laughs> they got little tiny gigantic bit added variations ball. when you let's say put this Broly against Super Saiyan Blue Gogeta. But anywho. I learned something that's very bad here. 
When you what? Do a big ball suit ultimate in front. Oh, it goes it, over them. The old Tenkaichi's, it's going to go over them. That's so you crazy. need to kind of have them a bit in front of you to, to hit. That's them with crazy, them. brother. Um, I, I don't learn my lesson until I do it one more time. So, do you guys see that wall stuff? It looks like you can break through the wall and end up in a different but situation. Yeah, that could yeah. just be me, like, wishfully thinking, you know, but it does look like you can crack through it. Good little back and forth here. Let, letting Vegeta know I'm not happy. Wow. Oh, my God. Let him know. Let him know, time. Sanju. And, uh, that was, was that, that? saying how? Saying spirit, which gave oh, okay. you some buffs that you said in my name. Like, how? Oh, shoot. Yeah, transform. Oh, that's the big transformation. So oh, I don't know Vegeta why, don't like I don't it know either. Why Vegeta did this, bro. That is disrespectful. That I did not respect that whatsoever. Oh, shoot. Yeah, that was disrespectful. Oh, what was that? I'm trying to see if he even get so anything off that. I don't know why. I don't know why Vegeta did this, bro. I don't know. That was disrespectful as hell. He didn't even get anything off that. I don't even think he got stock he off some that. Buffs you said in my name. Like, how? Oh, shoot. Yeah, transform. Uh, he didn't get anything off that. So he just. Sick. Did you just give up, Vegeta? What's this, good? Bro. I don't know why he did that because I did not respect. Yeah, that I, I don't know why either. Send <laughs> that was a weird, weird CPU moment. Weird CPU moment. That and man gave up. Got Golden Frieza. Now that man I gave didn't up. Get to see what Super Bro the Super Saiyan variation of Super Broly's ultimate did, but I, I can't imagine it's too much more than just an explosion. That Time's man up, gave up. Look at the coolest outro scene in the damn game. Hold on. Look at him! That's my son! Now, I was fairly excited to play as Beerus. I think this is more of a rhyme style type beat. This is rhyme That character. definitely is, is rhyme style's character, brother. This guy, but I wanted to see what he was hitting for. Just a little bit, you feel me? If you guys care to know my character, Goku, I will be there. I don't see anybody using Goku. You guys using Goku, I'm sorry. Y'all ain't like him. And I put him against Super Vegeta, which looks sick, dude. I don't know. I didn't get a chance to use him at all. I, I think his final flash was the real thing I wanted to see from him, but unfortunately he didn't do that at all in my gameplay. But this is one of Beerus's supers. I think it's it's kind of cool. Little ball. Very yeah, but it seems, dodge, yeah, it see. seems he are doing interesting move that I don't know how I did. It was like a hard counter to his grab. I would like to think you could do that with oh, just cool. uh, some attacks in general, specific oh, ones. I dash. used one of uh, Beerus's uh, I don't the know match. What type go. of move you would call this, Let's but it go. instantly let me power up and it spent some of the numbers that I had under my name. Yeah, that was that. Um, uh, that I didn't learn my lesson you. though, and I used my alt when he's right in front of me and I swing. And, it doesn't uh, destroy the miss. stage though. I really hate to see it. Didn't even, didn't even oh, flip wow. him whatsoever, bro. <laughs> it's, it's just hard. You just hate to see it. Um, That's I would crazy. like to think I try to hit that again though. I really want to see how that looks. Um, so mm, I hit him back. Nice. I charge up here. And he lets me have it. What really generous guy. I love this Vegeta folk, you know? So I get it here. Uh, or at least I get the charged up key. I think I get it here. I forgot what this looks like, but hold on, hold on. Survey says a swing. And uh, he got it. Nice. Yeah, okay. He added the extra just like when he did the Super Saiyan God Goku. Okay, valid. No stage valid. destruction, though. I think That's Vegeta died to that. Yep, yep, yep. Um, from here I did so why in these videos it actually has the falling animation But in the video the actual videos they were showing they're just stuck standing. That's Which so interesting Beerus out, I think I did learn something that I hope they do fix. I am pretty sure they're aware of this um, Hold on you're gonna see when I go close to uh, Super Vegeta and Wait, I don't it, know how, how many other is he stuck in the ground right now? They're big characters like this. They're gonna have into the game. I mean if they add some of the Z movie. Yeah, he was stuck in the ground. Whoa, 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 whoa. They need to fix that. They need to fix that camera now. The camera does not do justice on Big. They need to fix that camera now. It looked a lot better in the other video where they were showing like that that weird effect, that little peephole effect. They need to fix that Anybody? now. Fix it now. I'm not even joking. I, like, what is this? What are we looking at? What are we looking at? I'm sure they're gonna oh. fix it, but the camera should be like upward on the big, uh, the big things. I think. Uh, well, if they're gonna have it downward, they need to have that people effect, not a freaking like. There's you're getting caught by shadows. You're getting caught by the shaders. That's crazy. Maybe not going off the ground. Anyways, what my objective here 
where I had Goku out like this was to try to figure out how to fuse. I'm gonna fast forward that because just like my first. Oh, that's a I sick grab. Trial and errors. So let's say transformations are on the right D-pad. You then press R1 or L1 to switch to the fusion menu. Man, I'm so glad I watched that. You have the right partner on your team. Now I did learn you didn't have to have Goku or Vegeta in base if you have them both in your team. They automatically went to base. Man, if he transformed you know, or not transformed. He charges fast. Kind of cool. Right away, one for Big Bang coming out. Don't have a lot of time, so I wanted to see if I could hit. He killed and I him. Hit. He died immediately. It's insane. And 31 seconds. I what could I do here? What could I do here? I think frame one. Super I try to transform, on but I learned that transformations are connected to the stock. To yes, yes, yes. Let's go. One of those for transformation. That was so sick. Up until I that had combo that was one, sick. I was just kind of spamming some things. Super that was sick. Kind of a decent radius. I liked it a little bit. Um, just a little bit of hits, punches, a key blast that got dodged, a swing and a miss. It wasn't dodged. One, it was just the way the tracking was for it. Don't worry. Else. Wild sense. So basically, when he hits me, I it, you immediately go him, away from it. But yes. you will never get to see what that's like because time is up. I do redeem my Gogeta in the, was in the next one, I believe so. My next one was my best game for sure. But it also was when they told us we had five minutes left. What? I was stressing. Well, this is the final test. Final test of everything Yo. I, I kind of figured out. I Yo. cut a lot of it out. I'm stressing it with you I here. Was Five minutes left. Some of the, uh, okay. the, 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 the guide of how to do certain things because I was a little new here. And I did learn, at the very least, the perfect block little parry move. Nice. Um. Anywho, you do that by just blocking right when they attack. Nothing crazy, but I just... God bind is attached to the stock. That's unfortunate. Um, yeah, the, the map does not do Super Saiyan God Goku justice here. I will tell you that. <laughs> I wish I picked a different map to show him off a bit. But um, it's cool. It's cool. We scrapping. We scrapping. We're going back and forth. Trunks is putting up a fight. But I do really need to figure out how to do here, though. Lee. Which I it's saw vanished, the trailer vanished. is expending those uh those those points under my, my character to get, like, I guess, get uh, Trunks, in this case, off of me while he's attacking me using it as more of a deflect or something of the yeah, sort. Yeah, it depends on Anywho, what it is. I decided to go to Super Saiyan Blue just to kind of see the transformation in person. You know, we already saw this little trailer for this. But uh, one I thing we did see Vine. that I figured out on my lonely was KO Can Super Saiyan Blue. So uh, as Batamo kind of beats my ass a little bit, I'm Man, you have no my key, super brother. Menu, Damn. And I see that KO Ken is an option after I get like three little bars. Once I saw it, I realized I got to do it, bro. That did a perfect parry for the first time. I bro, think that was a revenge bro, counter. You, and I see that KO Ken is an option after I get like three little bars. Once I saw it, I realized I got to do it, bro. Oh, never that mind. That was a for the first time, bro. Bro, that shit was clutch. It did expend a, a bar though to do. I think I, I could be wrong. But do it, bro. That did a perfect parry for the first time. I am open it up did my use a bar. super menu, and I see that KO Ken is an option after I get like three little bars. Once I saw it, I realized I got to do it, bro. What? I did a perfect parry for the first time, bro. Maybe bro, it wasn't a perfect was parry then. It did expend a uh, a bar though to do. I think I, I could be wrong, but it's cool. Um, I do. I don't think that was a perfect God parry then. You're not. No, it's not no, supposed no, no. to use I'm stock just going to kill, bro. Damn, I forgot how a lot of this went. I was not playing, bro. <laughs> Oh my gosh, okay, got the counter, but even though I, I counted went behind him, he like started swinging and caught me. So you can't just do that freely. You can get caught lacking fairly easy. Okay. Now that I got three go key, um, I do. Do I go Kaoken here? No, 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 no. Dragon Fist, pretty much, pretty much. No hard that feelings was, here. Bro. Here I go, Kyle Ken. Bro, look at this shit. Look yeah, at the looks, heart. Man, it's it looks so like he's seamless. fast too. I thought it was gonna be a transformation, but it makes it's sense cool that, that it's not. not. Um, I think I like it like this a lot more. It's it a just status. Feels, it reminds me of how it, I played Tenkaichi and just used Goku's KO Ken, right? I like I like this. I know in the show a lot of times he just started using it just freely, and this is just the best uh, way I think that replicates that. Anyways, I switch out, go to Golden Freeze. I don't want to do too much on Goku. Like I said, I have barely any time left to do anything. So I want to show off the most I can with what I want to see. Damn. Um, Golden, Golden Freeza Freeza. does start off in base. I just chose to start him off transformed because that's what I really want to see. Um, mm. This is the Super Freeze as well, too, as you can tell mm. from the Halo. I don't they know didn't show the Halo in the other video. F version, but I, I think so it's probably going to be a costume, if anything. No moveset changes. You got this little Death Beam attack that looks looks very easily to dodge in this in this, in this camera angle. I, I don't know. It looked like it could have some tracking, Earth so, breaker. you know, look out for that. Then the ultimate. 
another AMV. <laughs> which oh i think he's dead this, i think oh, this, i wouldn't say my it's my favorite but the little spit effect was nice and then this was like a combination of like how frieza blew up earth fighting uh vegeta which was pretty cool and i think with this last bit of time i had left i went to super saiyan gogeta because you know i didn't really get a chance to transform into him, oh that was sick i wanted to at least see what they chose to do for his ultimate which i kind of knew but I waste time doing Damn. this long ass marathon little dash that I just shouldn't have done. <laughs> but um, nah, we all do yeah, it. Yeah, I, I all tried do to it. do it again. I just we literally have all like. done it. You know, this is the little hand movement. Mm. Uh, 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 uh. This game is so beautiful, dude. Dang! Oh Did you again. see the way he like. hit him into the ground? You know, this is the little hand movement. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, that's sick. Uh, uh, uh. The zoom out. I feel like you can make your own supers in this game if they allow you to with the diorama effect. That is sick. I feel like you know how they could make this better if they added like a little bit of a blur, like a motion blur behind uh, Vegeta, adding a little bit of that like shake. You know what I'm saying? And it being like, this game. like that, but a bit more engaging. The little hand movement. Uh, 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 uh. A bit the more engaged. That's too slow. That's too staticky, bro. It's, that doesn't, it's like, he got hit and it's like, what? You know, it's got to be more, for me personally, I feel like it should be more of a, Jesus Christ, you just got kicked by one of the strongest fighters in this universe. And it this does not feel like that. The oh, after effect dude. feels like oh, that. Oh my gosh, it's so good. Um, as I'm sure some of you guys who play Tenkaichi know, that is weird. Uh, when you do dash attacks that go into a cutscene, every move has a certain length of how far it will go. It's all based on that character, that move, that yeah. Go Start do that has Let's one go. that tracks your ass down. I think that one tracks too, but this is the last mm, move. I was able the to elbow do. Time was into up the right foot. when I hit this. Dude, I mean, we've seen this in so many games now, right? That's but look sick. at that explosion, bro, that I can't show anymore because I had to turn off the recording, bro. Now, everything from uh, this that's, portion onwards, that's I'm sick. watching for the first time with you guys in the presentation that we had before we got to play and get the footage that I just Wait, had. Wait, so what is this? Look like at least CPU. I'm just trying to get my little two cents in, too. <laughs> Wait, is this Bro, stuff that we've seen? Oh, okay, no, he's reacting to the stuff that we've seen now. All right, well, from his gameplay stuff, I feel like I've added a, a lot, actually. I feel like there's a lot that I added to that that he, he wasn't able to provide due to his difference in understanding between the games. It really does suck that Raging Blast 2 was so much different than Tenkaichi 3 because Raging Blast was more cancel-focused and the nuance between the movement in that game was like, you really had to know what you were doing if you want to make anything happen. You can open that game up right now. You'll see exactly what I'm talking about when it comes to Raging Blast 2. That game is not easy. And what's crazy is I actually had a video where I played with uh, another YouTuber. Uh, in that video, when we had played, I expected it to be, you know, like Tenka ET3. And granted, you know, it was a little bit laggy because we were playing on Parsec and I don't know what was going on there for where it, it could be laggy like that, but my inputs were a little bit delayed. But even outside of that, the inputs you had to do had to be like so preemptive that it was like, you you need to know the game before you actually start playing it. And it, it, that was very weird to me. And if that's what he's coming off of, coming on to Budokai Tenka HD3 or Sparking Zero, where you can just move, you know what I'm saying? You can just move, you can just attack, you can just do what you want to do. I can see how jarring that can be, especially when one was, like, hard focused for combat. This is focused for combat, but it's also focused for tactical decisions as well. So, I, you know, it's really cool. It's really cool to see everybody's reaction on it. It's really cool to see everybody's um understanding on the game. There isn't, like, too much I can provide outside of what I provided already in the video because a lot of things that... Oh my god. A lot of things that he was going over that we've seen, I've already addressed. 
you know what I'm saying? Uh, a lot of it was just hearing his thoughts before he got into his his um view of what we reacted to, you know what I'm saying? So I'm really excited. I'm really excited. I'm glad that he enjoyed this game. Uh, I'm glad that it is seeming like everything that I was looking forward to. There's nobody else that I'm going to react to that, like I said, th this is going to be the end of those like reaction videos in terms of like other YouTubers. Or, or maybe it won't be. I don't know. I just, I, me personally, I just don't like reacting to other people's videos like that. But I think when I have something to provide that isn't being spread around consistently, then, you know, it's worth having some sort of input. But yeah, I just want to share this with you. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, subscribe to the channel and like the video. And I will see you guys in the next one.